to put the pavement on the sky. Oh, I get it. <laughs> oh dear. I, I think it's basically because it's a church camp. Because the only place where I am is like at school. Not really from a church, and they're kind of mean. And also, people want to like take control. They don't care how other people feel. Church camps, stuff like that. People learn how to uh, how to think about others. Uh, so yeah, it's good. Church camp is probably one of my my favorite favorite pastimes. My favorite things to do. You get to come out for a week and be away from society and be away from real life and you get to just be alone in God's creation. Not just to be alone, but be with other fellow Christians in God's creation and be able to enjoy that and be able to grow spiritually at the time of growth. I'd say the major difference that I've noticed is I've got a lot more things in common with people here just because I do share my faith freely with, you know, my friends and things. And when I went to nature camps, it was, oh yeah, look, we're outside and it's fun and all, but here it's like we're all building towards something, you know. We all have the same common goals. Do it. It is, you'll have a great time. I think you'll be singing in the chapel. I love doing that. So far we've been studying about like promises that God made to like Abram. About he's gonna have babies and when they're really old they get one. This stuff. And we're talking about Moses. Uh, we got to cook. Yeah, yeah. We got to cook. cook your own meals. Cook your own meals? Where do you we cook them? Uh, we oh, cooked them at our fire. Over the fire. Over the fire. Uh, we uh, hiked earlier today. It was really great. Yeah. Where did you go? Uh, we just went out we the hiked all back around. there. And we, we got to take a challenge and go in that um, cave. Okay. Yeah, we saw like, it. Was well, like, it was like it a was little small, invention in the but rock. It was really cool. Yeah. cool. What, was, what was the cave like? It was, it was small. small. It was it like was tons of cool. sending people. Yeah. It's been a long time, so this really just renewed my love for camp. Because after that one summer, I wanted to go back to another year. But this is just like me being that camp, because I do a lot of the stuff that the kids do. Camp's really important because it, you just need to get away from home once in a while. And um, it's a great experience because it'll teach you to not be so like hanging on your parents. And it really brings God. I mean, I just feel like He's always with you. Because I personally feel good when I'm around other Christians. And I've always dreamed of a, of a program where young people can come to a church camp, spend the summer doing some intentional Christian discipleship, learning to integrate that with a work ethic, a work life, and a service, a servant's heart. I, I think that's tremendously valuable tool for the church because that's a time in life when, when young people are making decisions that will guide them for years. I guess it's when the kids come up at the end of the week and after they've been talking to me, hey Big Jeff, how you doing? Or hi Big Jeff all week long and then at the end of the week when mom and dad comes and they all just got to have that big last hug and a cry before they leave because they're going to miss us so much. So we've established that uh, family camp with the kids by the end of the week and they just they can't wait to get back here next year and, and those that have to, to go home on Friday and uh, won't be back for a year they're they're touched by the atmosphere here. In all life.